What's up everyone? Pody Lover 1989 here. Before I have to talk about another anime title, if you guys want me to watch and react to this series I My Me, comment your thoughts down below. Anyway, the next anime title I'll be telling you about is Akazuki Cha Cha. Akazuki Cha Cha is a Japanese shoujo manga series by Min Ayahana. It was serialized by Suisha in manga magazine Ribbon from 1992 to 2000 and collected in 13 bound volumes. The series is loosely based on the fairy tale Little Red Riding Hood and follows the adventures of a fumbling student magician named Cha Cha who habitually wears the red hooded cloak. A 74 anime TV show series based on the manga was produced by Nihon Ad Systems Inc. and TV Tokyo and was animated by an animation studio Gallop. The same animation studio that worked on high school Kimengumi. It was first broadcasted on TV Tokyo from January 7, 1994 to June 30, 1995. It was then followed by a series it was then followed by a sequel OVA with three episodes released between December 6, 1995 to March 6, 1996. In 1998, Cartoon Network aired an English dub version of the anime, only in Southeast Asia and Mandarin-speaking countries. In the anime, Cha-Cha seeks the truth about her family and defend the kingdom against its enemies. A two new shot, one-shot manga title Akazuki Cha Cha N was published in May 2011 and January 2012. Issues of Cookie Akazuki Cha Cha N became the monthly series published, but from 2012 to 2019, the version this version takes place in modern-day Tokyo, Japan. The genre of the series is a comedy and magical girl. Akazuki Cha Cha is the story about a young magic girl, a magical girl named Cha-Cha. She lives in a cottage on Mochi Mochi Mountain with Saravi, her guardian and teacher, who's the world's greatest magician. Cha-Cha is clumsy at casting spells, frequently mistaking homonyms, such as summoning spiders, Kubo in Japanese, instead of a cloud, also Kubo in Japanese. When she and her friends are in trouble, however, her spells do work. Living on the same mountain is a boy named Rira, Ria, the gifted with the enormous strength, who comes from a family of werewolves. Far away from Mochi Mochi Mountain is Urizuri Mountain, where Dorothy, the well-known magician that has a past with Saravi, lives in a castle with her student, Shide. Shide is also a young wizard who is adept at casting spells and barriers as well as transformations. The storyline of the manga and the anime are markedly different. While the anime uses most of the same characters, the story of the first two seasons were invented for the TV show. Most of the stories in the third season were based on the manga. At the beginning of the anime, when Chacho is about to begin school, Saravi gives her the pendant called the Princess Medallion and a magic bracelet and a ring to Rhea and Shine, respectively. The Princess Medallion enables Chacha to transform into a magical princess who can defeat Diabelle's minions when she shouts the phrase, Let love, courage, and hope, magical princess, holy up! However, their transformation only works if the three of them get together. In Season 1, Cha-Cha, Shide, and Rhea attend Urara School, named after their principal, Urara. The three are in the banana class with their teacher named Rascal Sensei, who wields a whip and looks strict, but also very kind. On the same class, Kurozukin, the black-hooded, Yako and Orin, Yako admires Saravi deep, deeply and even calls him Saravi-sama. Orin's a ninja of the Momonga clan and could have concealing herself. Orin is probably the most truthful character in the story as she develops a crush on Shine when they first met. Later, a selfish mermaid named Marin tags along because she is also interested in, Ri in Rhea. In the second season, after Cha-Cha's weapon, the beauty Serene Arrow was unable to defeat Di Diabelle's minions. Access, the trio, 
began to search for another more powerful weapon called the Phoenix Sword, or Wing Chris. But as they do this, Cha-Cha discovers that her parents are the king and queen of the land. After encountering many obstacles, they find the Phoenix Sword, then then begin their quest for the Bird Shield, the third weapon the magical princess must acquire to defeat Diamel's minions. At the end of the story arc, Cha-Cha, Shine, Rhea, Orin, Yako, Marin, Dorothy, and Saravi together, as the eight holy warriors of love, courage, and hope, get inside Diamel's castle. They then defeat Diabao, after which the castle and the kingdom changes back into its original shape and color. In Season 3, the King's Crest, which is a magical artifact called the Holy Bird, was stolen by Diabao's minions. Soprano, whoever, Soprano, whoever possesses the King's Crest can make the world good or evil. When Cha-Cha, as the magical princess, fights Soprano, by accident they break the seal, allowing all the demons to enter their world and devastate their land. Saravi then tells them to that to close the seal again, that they must use things that are from the gods or goddesses. Because the pendant, bracelet, and ring are given to them by Queen Joan, now a goddess, they sacrifice the three items in order to save the world. As a result, Cha-Cha can no longer change into a magical princess, but her family gives her three more magic items, a magical brooch, compact, and crescent aurora bracelet, which she can use to call up a boomerang, which in turn brings her items that can solve her problems. The rest of the series are based on the first five volumes of the manga. At the end of the, at the, end of the series, Saravi settles down, Engaged to get married to his former classmate, Dorothy. The series was adapted by an animated TV show produced by TV Tokyo and Nihon Ad Systems and is animated by Studio Gallup, the animation studio that worked on High School Kimengumi and Suideni Tonjikan. The series was also directed by Shoki Suji, with music by Osamu Tezuka, the creator of Astro Boy and Blue Blink and Marvelous Melbo and Princess Knight and many other related works, and Toshihiko Sahashi and the character designs by Hajime Watanabe. The opening theme is Kimi Iro Omoi, performed by a J-pop band from the 1990s, SMAP, capital S, capital M, capital A, capital P, during the original broadcast, and Shoko Sawada on the DVD release. There were three ending themes, Egao Gasuki da Kara, sung by Shoko Sawada from episodes 1 through 31, Chachani Omakase, sung by Masami Suzuki, Tomo Sakurai, and Mayumi Akado, for episodes 32 through 56, and Welcome to Magical School, or an original Japanese title, Yokoso Magikaru Sukuru E, performed by Masami Suzuki and Magical Study for episodes 57 through 74. Due to, being, due to the popularity of Sailor Moon at the time, which popularized the transforming heroines to, who fight, concept in Magical Girl anime, the first two seasons of Akazuki and Chacha featured an original plot line using the similar concept in order to compete. The series was first broadcasted in TV Tokyo in 74 episodes from January 7, 1994 to June 30, 1995. In 1998, Cartoon Network aired an English dub of the anime in Southeast Asia and Mandarin-speaking countries. Additionally, the series aired in Hong Kong, the ATV Network, the Philippines, the ABS-CBN channel of the Philippines, Cartoon Network, and Hero TV. The series was also aired in Indonesian dubbed by RCTI from 2002 to 2004 and Space Tomb between 2006 currently. And it is also an Indonesian channel. The television series was followed by a three-episode OVA series, also animated by Studio Gallup, the creator of High School Kimengumi, 
and many other works. They were released between December 6, 1995 and March 6, 1996. The opening theme for all the three episodes was Make Me Smile by Yuki Matsura, and the ending theme was Negai wa Hitotsu, also sung by that same artist, Yuki Matsura. The OVA series depicts the efforts of the elite Momiji school as they try to find out why the greatest witches and wizards in the school, why the greatest witches and the wizards in this world come from Urara school. A psionic named poppy Kun is sent to infiltrate the school, but things will not prove too easy when Chacha and her friends try to befriend poppy Kun instead. Akazuki and Chacha was also adapted as a series of video games. The one for Game Boy that was released in 1995, another one released in that same year for the X6800. No, it's the Sharp X68000, an old video game console that was released in the 1980s. The SNES in 1996, which is known as the Super Famicom, and, and the one that is by PCFX NEC Home Electronics, the one that is released in the 1980s, which is, which is the title also, also Wagase Panic Race. In popular culture, in the novel Death Note, another note, the Los Angeles BB murder cases, Akazuki and Cha Cha was also mentioned several times. Ru Ryuzaki mentions he loves Akazuki and Cha Cha and, and Shine in particular, and then notices that volumes 4 and 9 were missing from the collection, which is the vital clue to the case. Also in the manga City of Dead Sorcerer, Detective Kim calls the elusive murderer Crimson Robe several times Cha Cha while stating that he is a fan of the series as well. Anyway, this is basically all I can tell you about Akazuki and Cha Cha. I hope you enjoyed it. If you guys like me to talk about more anime titles like this, comment your thoughts down below. Or if you guys want me to watch and react to an entire anime TV show, the entire series or season of Pokemon, comment your thoughts down below. And if you like this video, click a thumbs up, notify me, and don't forget to subscribe. Pony Lover 1989 signing off, and I will see you all in the next video. Don't forget to keep praying, and I'll see you all later.